to change our lives forever. Building our nations and our homes, restoring sights to the blind, bringing hope to the hopeless. It goes beyond language barriers, 'cause it's a God carrier. It's our messenger angel to the rest of the world. It's rap so deep. Our reality is giving our lives a meaning. Rap so deep. Our reality is giving our day a lift. Directing our path, enlightening our world. Rap so deep. Our reality. Has come to change our lives forever. Today on Rhapsody of Realities, the best way to make our life count is to think about what we can do for others. Think of how you can give other people's lives a meaning. Over six billion people is a number one bestseller. It's in every continent and in every country, and communicates the realities of God's word in the simplest and most effective way in over 140 languages of the world. <laughs> Now everyone can understand the wisdom of God. Get your copy of the match edition of Rhapsody of Reality's Daily Devotional today and enjoy God's word like never before. You can call the numbers now showing on your screen or log on to www.rhapsodyofrealities.org to place your orders today. Rhapsody of Reality, giving your day a lift. Hello, a warm welcome to our beloved viewers from all around the world. We're reaching you from Nigeria, and I'm Dickness Nike Gwinga Kende. And with me on today's program is Dickness Beatrice Anoniga. It's great to be here with you again. This is still your favorite daily devotional program, The Rhapsody of, of Realities. Realities. And it's such an awesome privilege, you know, to go through the Word of God together with you. I'm sure you've been having a wonderful time. We are already in the month of March, in the year of, of the, the Word, Word of God. God. Wow. wow. That is awesome. Dickness. Two great months have passed. Yes, and now the Rhapsody is in 150 languages. Yes, indeed. That so is now we amazing. Have more people reading the Word of God, and this is the year of the Word of God. It's just awesome. Yes. And such a blessing to be able to read the Word of God in, in our languages. Yeah. Wow. Hallelujah. Praise and the Lord. that is tremendous. We thank the Lord for what the Lord is doing with the Rhapsody of Realities. And I'm sure you have a testimony mm -hmm. that you can share about the impact of the Rhapsody of Realities in your life. Mm -hmm. And have you been taking advantage of the translations that we have? I'm sure you have. I mean, buy your own copy in your own local language. Mm -hmm. Also, buy for others in your neighborhood, in your sphere of contact. Be God's point of contact to those in mm. your world and let them have access to the Word of God. The Word of God as contained in the Rhapsody of Realities is amazing. Yes. The power it has to transform mm. any life, mm. it's a wonder. And the testimony is the same from mm. all around the world. It does not matter yeah. where you are, your color, your background, your race. Mm -hmm. The impact of the Word is the same. Yes. So it doesn't matter. You don't have to feel That's right. as though as you're reading the Word of God, oh, something is... Some noise, uh, you know, you're yeah. hearing some shaking. You mm -hmm. don't have to feel it no. or, or, or hear it, no. but you can have a knowing. Just like our man of God has explained to us that when we eat food, that food is working in us, feeding our hands, our legs, our bodies, our minds, and we are being built up. Every cell is being built up. Mm -hmm. So also when we read the word of God, 
every part of our spirit man is being renewed Hallelujah. and revitalized Hallelujah. you know and it's just beautiful so we don't like you rightly said Dickness, we don't have to feel mm -hmm. like we're making progress but we know yes. that we are making progress so Hallelujah. make sure you get your copy of Rhapsody of Reality not just for this month but for every month from now on and read your Rhapsody daily so Glory that you are God. being built up by the word of God. Hallelujah. It's beautiful. This is the year of the word. Yes. The year for the lordship and dominion mm. of the word of God mm. in our lives. Yes. And that means like never before, we must pay attention mm. and give time, mm. quality time to our communion with the word of God. And we have the messenger angel, mm. the rhapsody of realities as our able help mm -hmm. in guiding us, you know, piloting us all the way through the word, yes. such that every day we can read the Rhapsody of Realities, we can learn from it. Mm. And like I always say, the anointing that is contained in the Rhapsody of Realities is what makes the difference. Yeah. You not only have knowledge coming mm. to you, but you also have the impartation of the spirit, spirit. that brings the ability to mm. do into the word that you are receiving. And the Bible has said to us that it's the doer of the word that is wow. blessed in his deed. Yeah. So as you do the word as contained in the Rhapsody of Realities, you are certainly blessed. Mm -hmm. Your life can never be the same. Mm -hmm. No wonder you will always have testimonies upon testimonies as you consistently read and meditate on the word of God. Wow. Now, Pastor has a divine message for us today. Yes, and today is March 5th, and Pastor is telling us today, win for others and that is just so instructive indeed absolutely so go ahead and get your own copy of the rhapsody of realities for the mm. month of march mm. and join us as we have a swell time with the word of god mm. on today's program see you after the break what if what i desire i already have and my dreams are not as impossible what if what i want is not what I need and there is more in me that I'm yet to discover can I trust God enough to lead me to guide me to show me who I really am get Rhapsody of Realities and get all the answers you need start placing your orders now call the number showing on your screen or visit our website www.rhapsodyofrealities.org Rhapsody of Realities, giving your day a lift. Welcome back. Today is March 5th, and Pastor Chris's message for us today is Win for Others. And the theme scripture is taken from Genesis chapter 45 and verse 7. And God sent me before you to preserve you a posterity in the earth and to save your lives by a great deliverance. Glory wow. to God. And remember that this quote was made by Joseph. Mm -hmm. You know, what he said to his brothers when after they were reunited in Egypt mm -hmm. and his brothers were so, you know, filled with condemnation, mm -hmm. you know, apologizing for the fact that they were the ones that sold him into slavery. Mm -hmm. And now he, he, I mean, they find him as the mm -hmm. prime minister of Egypt. And so they were so full of condemnation. Mm -hmm. But here, Joseph was speaking to them that, no, God has sent me ahead of you, of you, not just to preserve mm -hmm. your lives, but to preserve the whole world. Mm -hmm. Because he has come for such a time when mm -hmm. there was going to be famine, yeah. severe famine in the world. Mm -hmm. But by the wisdom that God has given to him, he was able to not only preserve mm -hmm. Egypt, but actually the whole world was preserved wow. because of the wisdom that God gave Joseph. Mm -hmm. And so, Pastor is saying to us today, that is an example we all can learn from. Win for, for others. others. That's Glory right. to God. Pastor starts by saying, the victory of Jesus over sin, death, and the devil wasn't for himself, but for us. Hallelujah. He battled on our behalf and gave us the victory. Now we've become more than conquerors. conquerors. That's true success. Amen. It's winning for others, helping them achieve and become what God has destined for them to be. Wow. wow. Pastor says, realize that what you make happen for others, the Lord will make happen for you. Win, Win for others. others. Glory wow. to God. This is wonderful. I mean, it's true. 
I mean, I never saw it like this before. You know, that Pastor. really, Jesus actually, yes, mm -hmm. the scripture talks about the fact that God gave his only begotten son mm -hmm. that we may have life. Mm -hmm. But to look at it from the point of view of what Jesus did, mm -hmm. I mean, he actually gave himself on our behalf such that we can become conquerors. Mm -hmm. The Bible talks about it also that he was made poor, that we through his poverty might, might become be rich. rich. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Glory to God. That's beautiful. And you know, Pastor taught us this year, when he was uh, ministering but through the spirit